Good morning, Dr. Bedford. Good morning, Nate. Boy, you sure look terrible. Nate, pour the coffee. Did you make house calls again last night? No, I entered a dance contest at Roseland. <laughs> now, that's funny. <laughs> Hi, Dad. Hello, son. Dad, you look terrible. I heard. <laughs> How are Jenny and the kids? Fine. Morning, Dr. Bedford. Ah, morning. Uh, just a Danish, Nate. Right. Uh, Dr. Bedford, mm. my thumb, mm. it hurts every time I do that. Then don't do that. <laughs> I mean, if you have to do that, do that with your other thumb. You think maybe I've been sleeping on it? Nate, tonight I'll come over and watch. <laughs> Nate, 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 stop by my office this afternoon. <laughs> Nobody brings a thumb to Park Avenue. Dad, I wasn't gonna charge Nate. Of course not. You were gonna send him to a thumb specialist and split the fee with him. <laughs> oh, you really don't understand that medicine is a business, do you? Yeah, how's business? What are you gonna do? You gonna spend the rest of your life in that godforsaken dump on the west side? Look, Dad, you know, it's always been my dream that you and I could share a practice on Park Avenue. Do you know I had the same dream? That's why I quit eating salami at night. <laughs> okay, 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 just drop it. Did you get the lab reports back on Arthur Jarvis? Yeah. I needed another opinion. I sent him to Walters. What? Don't gulp your coffee. You sent him to Walters? Yeah. Dad, I've known Arthur all my life. Why didn't you send him to me? David, the man is sick. I really <laughs> I'm sorry, that was really unkind of me. I apologize. You're a fine doctor. And I'm an adult. Yeah. Look, Dad, I always want you to be my father, but I want to be your son, not your kid. You're right. Thank you. Absolutely right. Thank you. <laughs> this way, the crumbs will fall on the napkin and not on your pants. Many adults have to be told this. 